on the day of my cardiac arrest. I don't remember much, really all I remember on the day was running down a football pitch and then just everything goes black. And I got a call from the head teacher to say, can I, can I get to the school as quickly as possible because something's happened to Harry. I just remember looking at a photo of him on my phone and I just kept looking at it and just asking him to kind of like hold on and it was a really traumatic experience. When I was told, I remember feeling quite confused because I was told I had a heart condition. Because I was only seven at the time, I couldn't quite wrap my head around what was going on. Honestly, at sometimes it was quite scary. The only way I coped was through family and friends who, was, who were always there to support me no matter what. When I had my ICD fitted, because I was only seven, I didn't really understand what it was and I compared myself to people like Iron Man and I thought it was quite a cool thing. The British Heart Foundation is really inspiring to me and I'm really proud that there are places like that that are doing research into a variety of heart conditions. I am so proud of Harry and I thought I'd lost him. I can just remember thinking, God, even if he just gets to his 14th birthday, I'd be so grateful after what I experienced. We've gone past that now and he's just this amazing boy. The British Heart Foundation is really inspiring to me. I believe that the research can help people like me and other people alike if their condition might be more serious than mine. It can really change their lives uh, for the better.